just a few short seconds, Obi-Wan uses his greatest mind trick and a gambit of psychological strategy against his oldest foe in Star Wars, Darth Maul. Obi-Wan didn't even need to use the Force to pull his greatest psychological trick on Darth Maul during their final fight in Star Wars Rebels. In just a single scene, Kenobi took viewers on a journey of growth and of strategy from his past as Obi-Wan and to the present and future as Ben. As they both prepared to fight, Obi-Wan first assumed his classic prequel form 3 fighting stance. This position was only for an instant of time, but it certainly conjured up memories of a younger and cockier Obi-Wan. But Obi-Wan quickly transitioned into Form 4 stance, favored by his old master Qui-Gon Jinn. Obi-Wan's transition of stance has satisfied two objectives. First, Obi-Wan recognized that the old ways were gone, and he was no longer the same Jedi he was ages ago. As Ben Kenobi, he was wiser and calmer, and secondly, by assuming the pre-fight pose of Qui-Gon, this triggered Maul into thinking that he could use the same move that he had killed his former master with, and Maul rushed to attack the Jedi. But it was a carefully laid trap, and Obi-Wan fulfilled the poetic circle by blocking Maul's signature move, and one that had killed Qui-Gon, and instead mortally wounding Maul.